What is up everybody and welcome to another episode brought to you by Backyard Zombie. And in today's video, as you can see, I have a very special guest with me because I'm going to be doing a review of the Trick or Treat Studios plush good guy doll. So, let's get started. So I picked up my good guy plush from a very special toy store called Time Bomb Toys. If you follow us on Instagram or if you remember our video trip from there last year, we picked up the Evil Dead 2 Kandarian Demon Dagger, also by Trick or Treat Studios. And I decided that I really wanted one of these good guy dolls, so I jumped on a chance to run out to Pittsburgh and go pick this up from my buddy Bob who owns Time Bomb Toys. And yeah, I thought I would show this guy off to you guys today and we do an in-depth review because this thing <laughs> is I've always wanted a good guy doll and paying $500 for a doll is just, I don't want to do it. But when they released this kind of economy version, I knew I had to have it. So let's get really up close and personal with this doll and yeah, let's get into it. Okay, here's the doll in all of its glory and this is an amazing collaboration between Trick or Treat Studios and Garrett Zima. The doll is so cool to look at and it's awesome owning a one-to-one -one scale replica. The head sculpt is great. I love the hair, I love the sculpt. It's just such a cool doll. Here I am demonstrating that this is a plush doll. You can squeeze it. Try not to squeeze it on the microphone. Um, yes, his hair is very crazy. Um, I believe from what I've been guessing that some people, or like Trick or Treat Studios knew that some people would customize these dolls. So they just gave you an easel to work with. So if you want to take this to like a, um, a hairdresser and have them done, yeah, I might do that when I decide to customize this doll. My biggest um, nitpick with this doll is that, that the overalls are too big. Like, the strappings for them, are just, it's just, it's too big. And yeah, it would have been nice to get like corduroy, but that's totally cool. Eventually, I might buy an entire new outfit for this doll to be more screen accurate. But let's keep looking at the doll and keep looking at all of its features. Looking for something fun to get somebody for Christmas? Well, this year we have our exclusive Santa Zombie shirts back in the store. They are available in kids and adult sizes. This year we're also offering this exclusive green, forest green shirt. And we also offer a red one that we offered last year. So yeah, go grab your ugly Christmas sweater with our Santa Zombie logo by Chen's Art. Now on our Teespring in the description down below. The doll itself comes pre-tagged from Trick or Treat Studios with this cool good guy tag. Uh, the hands are sculpted very well and as you can see the sweater is not hand sewn and the overalls are not corduroy but that's just a little nitpick but this doll as you can see cannot pose itself and I've noticed that the overalls are very well screen printed but they are a little bit big for this doll. I'm not a shoe person in real life, but these shoes are just so cool. They are so well sculpted, and as you can see, that is a plush foot that you have to shove into the shoe. But look at all the detail. I believe these are the same exact shoes that are sculpted on the more more expensive doll, but even the shoelaces, the screen accurate bottoms, these are just so freaking cool to look at, and they are hard plastic, so that's so freaking cool. I mean, for a $200 doll, this is worth every penny. And those are my final thoughts on the Trick or Treat Studios Good Guy Plush. And I, yeah, I got some nitpicks about it, but it's just so cool to own a full replica Good Guy doll from Garrett Zima, from Trick or Treat Studios. Like it's, it's just, it, it speaks for itself. It's such a cool prop. It's such a cool doll. So I really hope you guys enjoyed this video and I really hope you guys enjoy meeting Chucky and, uh, I don't remember buying that elf, but yeah, we'll get to that another time. So yeah, thank you guys so much for subscribing, for watching the video, for liking it, and I will see you guys in the next video. Oh my God, does he ever shut up? Oh, you all just wait. You're in for a real treat here very soon.